In the 1970s, Diane Keaton graced screens and left a lasting impression with her distinctive style and powerful presence. Though famously portraying Kay Adams Corleone in The Godfather, the actress's own story remains captivating. Delving into her personal views on love and matrimony reveals a unique perspective. This legendary figure, celebrated for her work, held beliefs that might surprise you. Let's explore these revelations together. Initially, Diane was inspired to pursue acting after witnessing her mother win the Mistress Los Angeles pageant at the young age of nine. This event sparked a deep admiration for performance and creativity within her. As she entered high school, she embraced her passion more fully by joining acting and singing clubs. These experiences allowed her to explore her talents and solidified her love for the stage. She found joy in expressing herself through characters and music, laying the foundation for her future in the entertainment industry. The combination of early inspiration and active participation in school activities set the stage for her burgeoning career as she began to discover her unique voice and presence. In a decision that would shape her future, Diane Keaton, then still a young woman, decided to drop out of college to pursue her passion for acting. This choice marked a turning point in her life, leading her down a path that would eventually see her become one of Hollywood's most beloved actresses. Keaton recognized that she needed formal training to hone her craft, and so she enrolled at the prestigious Neighborhood Playhouse School of Theater in New York City. There, under the tutelage of renowned acting teacher Sanford Meisner, she honed her skills and developed the unique style that would come to define her career. The Neighborhood Playhouse provided Keaton with a rich and diverse learning environment where she studied alongside other aspiring actors who would go on to achieve great success in their own right. Through rigorous training, and countless hours of practice, Keaton learned to tap into her emotions, delivering powerful and nuanced performances that captivated audiences. At the Neighborhood Playhouse, Keaton also discovered the importance of discipline and hard work, qualities that would serve her well throughout her career. She approached each class and rehearsal with dedication and commitment, always striving to improve her craft and push herself to new heights. After completing her training at the Neighborhood Playhouse, Keaton began auditioning for roles on stage and screen. Her natural talent and unwavering determination quickly paid off, landing her first major role in the hit Broadway production Hair. From there, she went on to star in numerous films and TV shows, cementing her status as a true icon of American cinema. Throughout her illustrious career, Keaton has remained committed to her craft, continually pushing herself to explore new territory and take on challenging roles. And it all started with a bold decision to drop out of college and follow her dreams, a decision that ultimately led her to the Neighborhood Playhouse and launched her on the road to stardom. Diane Keaton quickly made a name for herself in the movie industry through her distinctive acting style. She had a unique approach to her roles, making sure to memorize the entire script before even starting to film. This commitment to preparation allowed her to truly inhabit each character she played contributing to her rapid rise to fame. Despite being a relative newcomer to Hollywood, Diane was unwilling to compromise her values for the sake of fitting in with industry standards. For instance, when offered a role in the Broadway production of Hair, she flatly refused to perform naked, despite it being a common practice at the time. Her steadfast dedication to maintaining her personal integrity, even in the face of pressure to conform, further solidified her reputation as a serious and respected actress. Throughout her career, Diane has continued to push boundaries and challenge expectations, all while remaining true to herself. Whether appearing in comedies, dramas, or romantic films, she consistently brings depth and nuance to every performance, cementing her place as a beloved and iconic figure in American cinema. Diane Keaton's role as Kay Adams in The Godfather truly marked a turning point in her career. This groundbreaking performance provided the stepping stone for the actress to explore various genres beyond drama including romantic comedies and action films. Keaton's portrayal of Kay Adams was both nuanced and captivating, making her stand out among the talented cast of The Godfather. Her ability to convincingly play a strong-willed woman who becomes entangled in a dangerous criminal underworld caught the attention of audiences and critics alike. Following this success, she went on to establish herself as a versatile performer capable of delivering compelling performances across different movie styles. One notable example of Keaton's versatility can be seen in her work alongside Woody Allen and Annie Hall, which earned her an Academy Award for Best Actress. In this classic romantic comedy, she played the titular character, a quirky and neurotic singer 
displaying remarkable range and depth. Through her collaboration with Alan, their unique chemistry shone through, solidifying their status as one of Hollywood's most iconic duos. Apart from her successful pairing with Alan, the actress has also demonstrated her prowess in more physically demanding roles. For instance, in the action-packed thriller The First Wives Club, she shared the screen with fellow A-list actresses Goldie Hawn and Bette Midler. Together, they formed a formidable trio, seeking revenge against their unfaithful ex-husbands, resulting in a hilarious and empowering cinematic experience. Throughout her illustrious career spanning over five decades, Diane Keaton has consistently proven her adaptability and talent. From dramatic turns to side-splitting comedies, her contributions continue to resonate deeply with generations of fans. Even today, her impact remains palpable, inspiring aspiring actors and leaving an indelible mark on cinema history. Diane Keaton, the actress known for her unique style and distinctive voice, had a professional and personal relationship with director Woody Allen in the early 1970s. They first met while working together on the set of Play It Again, Sam in 1972, and their connection quickly turned romantic. However, their relationship was short-lived and came to an end later that same year. Despite their split, they continued to work together and maintain a strong friendship. One of Keaton's earliest ventures outside of acting was her work as a photographer for Rolling Stone magazine. She captured striking images of various musicians and celebrities during her time there, further solidifying her status as a multi-talented artist. Keaton also tried her hand at real estate development. Her passion for architecture and design led her to purchase, renovate, and sell properties throughout Los Angeles. This venture allowed her to express herself creatively while also staying active behind the scenes. Throughout her career, Diane Keaton has proven herself to be more than just a talented actress. From her photography work to her dabbling in real estate, she continues to explore different artistic avenues and challenge herself in new ways. However, her romantic life featured notable relationships with figures such as Warren Beatty and Al Pacino, which drew public attention. There was also a brief date with Steve Jobs in the 1980s that became a point of interest. Over time, the actress came to understand that her views on love and marriage had been impractical. Instead of trying to fit into traditional roles, she chose to focus on being a good partner and building a supportive team with her significant other. This shift in perspective allowed her to approach relationships with a more realistic and grounded mindset. After facing personal trials, including the loss of her father and her own battle with skin cancer, actress Diane Keaton found joy and purpose in an unexpected place, motherhood. At the age of 53, she adopted her first child, a son named Dexter. Six years later, she welcomed another son, Duke, into her family. The road to adoption was not easy for Keaton. She faced skepticism and criticism from those who questioned her decision to become a single mother at an unconventional age. But Keaton remained steadfast in her determination to become a mom, proving that it's never too late to follow one's dreams. Throughout her life and career, Diane Keaton has challenged societal norms and expectations around traditional milestones like marriage and parenthood. For her, personal fulfillment and impact have always taken precedence over conventional paths. As a result, she has left an indelible mark on Hollywood and beyond. Despite being known for her iconic roles in films like Annie Hall and Something's Gotta Give, Keaton has consistently prioritized her private life over her public persona. Her dedication to her sons demonstrates her commitment to creating a meaningful legacy outside of the spotlight. As a testament to her influence, Keaton remains a beloved figure in pop culture today. Through her timeless acting performances and her advocacy for women's rights and individuality, she continues to inspire generations of fans. And while she may not have followed a typical path, Keaton's contributions to society will undoubtedly resonate for years to come. In the ever-evolving landscape of cinema, Diane Keaton has made a lasting impression. Born Diane Hall on January 5, 1946, in Los Angeles, California, she embarked on a journey that would lead her to become one of Hollywood's most cherished actresses. Keaton's career took off when she was cast in the groundbreaking Broadway production Hair in 1968, but it was her collaboration with renowned director Woody Allen that truly catapulted her to stardom. Their partnership resulted in several unforgettable films, including Play It Again, Sam, Sleeper, and the iconic Annie Hall which earned Keaton her first Academy Award for Best Actress in 1978. Throughout her illustrious career, Diane Keaton has shown immense versatility, seamlessly moving between comedy and drama. She delivered powerful performances in heavy dramas like the Godfather trilogy, 
and lighter fare such as Father of the Bride. Her work resonates deeply with audiences, transcending generations, and remaining etched in cinematic history. Off-screen, Keaton is known for her unique style and bold fashion choices, often donning suits, hats, and sunglasses, making her stand out in the bustling world of celebrity. Moreover, she's authored several books reflecting on life, love, and home design, further showcasing her multifaceted talents beyond acting. As we delve deeper into the rich tapestry of Diane Keaton's life and career, we find ourselves stepping into a world filled with laughter, tears, triumphs, and timeless artistry. A world where dreams turn into reality, shaping the annals of film history along the way. Diane Keaton was born on January 5, 1946, 1946, in Los Angeles, California. Her father, Jack Hall, was a civil engineer, and her mother, Dorothy Diane Keaton, a homemaker. Diane has two brothers, Robin and Randy. She was named Diane after her mother's favorite actress, Diane Cassidy. From an early age, Diane was interested in performing arts. At age five, she started taking dance lessons, and by nine, she had developed a love for acting. Diane attended Santa Ana High School, where she participated in school plays. After high school, she enrolled in Orange Coast College, but soon transferred to the Neighborhood Playhouse in New York City to study acting. There, she met her mentor, Sanford Meisner, whose teachings would greatly influence her career. Under his guidance, Diane honed her skills in method acting. Meanwhile, Diane's parents also played a significant role in shaping her artistic pursuits. They regularly took her to movies, instilling in her a deep appreciation for cinema. This early exposure to films sparked Diane's interest in storytelling through visual media. As she once said, I grew up going to the movies all the time, it was my education. Another pivotal figure in Diane's life was director Woody Allen, who gave her one of her first major film roles in Play It Again, Sam Sam. Working with him allowed Diane to explore comedy and cemented her status as a talented comedic actor. Later, when they collaborated again in Sleeper, Love, and Death, and Manhattan Diane continued refining her comic timing while also displaying dramatic depth. Apart from Woody Allen, another influential person in Diane's career was Warren Beatty, whom she met during the making of Reds. Their professional partnership turned personal, leading to a relationship that lasted several years. During this period, Beatty encouraged Diane to take more control over her career choices, further empowering her as an artist. Ever since Diane Keaton was a young girl, she had a deep love for storytelling. She would often put on shows for her family, complete with costumes and props made from household items. Her mother, a homemaker and amateur photographer, encouraged her creativity and captured many of these early performances on film. Keaton's passion for acting continued to grow throughout her teenage years. After graduating high school, she attended Santa Ana College where she studied drama and appeared in several stage productions. It was during this time that she realized she wanted to pursue a career in acting. One pivotal experience that further fueled Keaton's desire to become an actress occurred while she was studying at the Neighborhood Playhouse School of the Theater in New York City. There, she met influential teacher Sanford Meisner, who taught her the importance of emotional truth and authenticity in performance. Under his guidance, Keaton honed her craft and developed her unique style, which combines humor, intelligence, and vulnerability. Another significant moment came when she landed the role of Kay Adams Corleone in Francis Ford Coppola's iconic film The Godfather. Although it wasn't initially clear if she was right for the part, Keaton's audacity and talent ultimately won over the director. This breakthrough role not only launched her film career, but also solidified her place in Hollywood history. Throughout her illustrious career, Diane Keaton has remained dedicated to her craft, continually pushing boundaries and taking on diverse roles that showcase her versatility and range. From her groundbreaking work in theater and film to her successful ventures in photography, interior design, and writing, Keaton continues to inspire generations of artists with her creative spark. Diane Keaton's journey to stardom was marked by numerous obstacles. Born in Los Angeles on January 5, 1946, she initially pursued a career in photography before shifting her focus to acting. Finances were tight for the young artist, often leading to evictions from apartments due to unpaid rent. But Diane remained undeterred, working odd jobs like waitressing to support herself while auditioning for roles. The entertainment industry proved skeptical about accepting Diane into its fold. At 5 feet 7 inches tall, she didn't fit the mold of typical Hollywood leading ladies who were usually petite and glamorous. 
However, Diane used this perceived disadvantage creatively, embracing her unique appearance and developing quirky, offbeat characters that resonated deeply with audiences. Despite facing repeated rejections during casting calls, Diane persevered. She joined the famous actor's studio to hone her craft further under renowned director Lee Strasberg. Her hard work paid off when she landed significant roles, including one alongside Woody Allen in Play It Again, Sam, which led to more substantial opportunities later. One notable challenge was balancing personal life and professional commitments. After achieving success, relationships became difficult due to demanding schedules. Nevertheless, Diane adapted again, choosing projects carefully so as not to compromise family time too much. To this day, she continues to captivate us through diverse roles spanning film, television, and even music videos, proving once again how overcoming adversity can lead to remarkable achievements. After studying drama at Santa Ana College, a neighborhood playhouse in New York, Diane Keaton landed her first film role in Lovers and Other Strangers. However, it wasn't until she worked with director Woody Allen that her career truly took off. Their collaboration on Play It Again, Sam marked a significant breakthrough for Keaton, earning her critical praise and solidifying her status as a talented up-and-coming actress. Her iconic performance as Kay Adams Corleone in Francis Ford Coppola's The Godfather, alongside legends like Marlon Brando and Al Pacino, further elevated her profile. Despite initial apprehension about taking on what seemed like a conventional female character, Keaton brought depth and nuance to the role, which became pivotal in shaping her career. The following year, Keaton reunited with Woody Allen for Sleeper, showcasing her comedic prowess. This led to another successful collaboration in Annie Hall, where she delivered a captivating portrayal of the titular character, winning an Academy Award for Best Actress, making her one of the few women to achieve this distinction sans makeup. Throughout the late 70s and early 80s, Keaton continued pushing boundaries, exploring diverse genres, including romantic comedy, musical drama, and even playing against type and crime thrillers. These roles underscored her versatility and commitment to authentic storytelling, cementing her place among Hollywood's most respected artists. Critics often highlight how Keaton has consistently chosen parts that resonate deeply with audiences while challenging societal norms. As Pauline Kael once noted, Diane Keaton brings so much intelligence and wit to every role. Indeed, through compelling performances across various mediums, Keaton leaves an indelible mark on cinema, inspiring generations of actors and directors alike. Diane Keaton's artistic vision is deeply rooted in her unique perspective and life experiences. Growing up in Los Angeles, she was exposed to the glamour and excitement of Hollywood from a young age. However, it wasn't until she attended college that she discovered her passion for acting. Keaton's approach to her work is thoughtful and introspective. She has a talent for bringing complex and nuanced characters to life on screen. Her performances are often marked by a quiet intensity and a deep emotional resonance. This can be seen in some of her most iconic roles, such as Annie Hall in the film of the same name and Kay Adams in the Godfather trilogy. One of the things that sets Keaton apart as an actress is her willingness to take risks and challenge herself. She has tackled a wide range of roles throughout her career, from comedies to dramas to musicals. In each case, she brings a distinct sense of vulnerability and authenticity to her performance. Another key aspect of Keaton's artistic vision is her dedication to craft. She is known for her meticulous preparation and attention to detail. This can be seen in everything from her costumes to her line delivery to her body language. At the heart of Keaton's work is a deep desire to explore the human condition. Whether she is playing a quirky artist or a tough-as-nails detective, she always finds ways to connect with her audience and convey the complexity and depth of her characters. Of course, Keaton's personal experiences and worldview have also played a significant role in shaping her art. Throughout her career, she has been outspoken about issues related to women's rights, mental health, and social justice. These themes often find their way into her work, adding another layer of meaning and significance. Overall, Diane Keaton's artistic vision is characterized by her commitment to authenticity, her willingness to take risks, and her deep connection to the human experience. Through her work, she invites us to see the world in new and unexpected ways and to appreciate the beauty and complexity of our own lives. Diane Keaton, born January 5, 1946, has left an indelible mark on Hollywood. She's known for her unique style and unconventional roles, often playing complex and independent women. 
Her work has significantly impacted both the film industry and popular culture. Keaton's influence can be seen in various aspects of modern cinema. According to renowned director Nancy Myers, Diane brought a new kind of woman to the screen, intelligent, funny, and unafraid to be herself. This is evident in Keaton's early performances, such as her role in Annie Hall, which won her an Academy Award for Best Actress. Her character's quirky fashion sense also sparked a trend among viewers. As fashion historian Caroline Reynolds Milbank notes, Diane Keaton's style in Annie Hall changed the way women dressed in the late 70s. Ties, vests, and oversized sunglasses became must-haves overnight. Moreover, Keaton's willingness to take on diverse roles has paved the way for future actresses. Actor Ellen Page states, Seeing Diane's career encouraged me to explore different types of characters. She showed me that it's okay to challenge stereotypes and expectations. Furthermore, Keaton's body of work often explores themes like independence, self-discovery, and female friendship, contributing to more nuanced portrayals of women in films. Director Ava DuVernay adds, Diane's commitment to authenticity and depth in her roles challenges us all to tell better stories about women. In conclusion, Diane Keaton's contributions extend beyond acting. Through her distinctive style, groundbreaking roles, and advocacy for meaningful storytelling, she continues to inspire generations of actors and directors alike. Diane Keaton, renowned actress, has led a fascinating life beyond the silver screen. She's known for her unique style and individuality, often seen sporting menswear-inspired outfits and hats. This interest in fashion transcends her personal life, influencing some of her most iconic film roles like Annie Hall. Keaton is also deeply committed to various charitable causes. One area close to her heart is adoption advocacy. Having adopted two children herself, she has been candid about her experiences and uses her platform to raise awareness around this issue. In addition, she supports Alzheimer's research in honor of her brother who suffered from the disease. Her love for architecture and interior design is another facet of her life that seeps into her work. Her passion project, House, explores different architectural styles across America, reflecting her keen eye for aesthetics. Moreover, she designed the set of the movie interiors, drawing inspiration from her own home. Diane Keaton's personal values, honesty, authenticity, compassion, shine through every aspect of her career and private life. Whether it's championing women's rights, supporting underprivileged children, or promoting environmental conservation, Keaton leads by example, leaving an indelible mark on both Hollywood and society at large. Indeed, her legacy extends far beyond just acting, making her a true inspiration for many. Diane Keaton's legacy in Hollywood is marked by her unique charm and exceptional talent. With iconic roles in films like Annie Hall and Something's Gotta Give, she has demonstrated versatility and range as an actress. Over the course of her five-decade career, she has received numerous accolades, including an Academy Award, cementing her place among cinema greats. Keaton's impact extends beyond acting, as she is also celebrated for her work behind the camera as a director and producer. Her bold choices and distinct artistic vision have left an indelible mark on both film and television. As for the future, Diane Keaton continues to inspire up and coming professionals with her unwavering commitment to creativity and originality. She remains active in the industry through various projects, proving that age is just a number when it comes to pursuing one's passion. For those looking to follow in her footsteps, Keaton offers valuable advice never shy away from taking risks and always stay true to yourself. In her own words, I think that you have to believe in your instincts and trust them you may not always be right, but you will never regret following your heart. Aspiring actors and artists can learn from Keaton's willingness to push boundaries and embrace new challenges throughout her illustrious career. Diane Keaton's journey in Hollywood has been nothing short of remarkable. Born January 5, 1946, she started her career on stage but quickly made her mark in film. Her groundbreaking role in Annie Hall brought her critical acclaim and solidified her place as a leading lady. Keaton's innovative approach to acting set her apart from her peers. She challenged traditional norms and brought a unique style to each character she played. From comedy to drama, she navigated different genres with ease and grace. Throughout her career, Keaton received numerous accolades, including an Academy Award, cementing her status as a true icon in the entertainment industry. But it was more than just awards that made her impact endure. It was her unwavering dedication to her craft and her willingness to take risks. Her work resonates deeply with audiences because she consistently delivers authentic performances that touch the heart. 
Whether playing a quirky love interest or a strong independent woman, she brings depth and nuance to every role. Behind the scenes, Keaton also left her mark by advocating for women's rights and equal pay in the industry. Her activism extended beyond Hollywood too, as she used her platform to raise awareness about social issues and inspire change. Diane Keaton's legacy continues to influence new generations of actors and filmmakers. Through her passionate commitment to storytelling and her fearless pursuit of innovation, she reminds us all of the transformative power of creativity and persistence. As we reflect on her incredible journey, let us remember that our own paths can be shaped by these same qualities. As we gather here today, let's take a moment to appreciate the incredible career of Diane Keaton. With her unique style and undeniable talent, she has left an indelible mark on the film industry. Keaton began her acting journey in the late 1960s, but it was her role as Kay Adams in the Godfather trilogy that catapulted her to stardom. Her portrayal of the intelligent, and strong-willed character captured audiences' hearts and showcased her versatility as an actress. Throughout her career, Keaton has taken on various roles spanning different genres, from comedies like Annie Hall, which earned her an Academy Award, to dramas such as Something's Gotta Give. She consistently delivers captivating performances, making each character she plays memorable and relatable. But beyond her impressive filmography, Diane Keaton has also made significant contributions to other areas of the entertainment industry. From singing and dancing in musicals to lending her voice to documentaries, she continues to expand her artistic horizons. Now, over five decades into her career, Diane Keaton remains a vibrant force in Hollywood. At 75 years young, she shows no signs of slowing down, recently appearing in hit TV series like The Good Wife and Grace and Frankie. As you reflect on Diane Keaton's remarkable career, feel free to share your favorite memories and moments in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the inspiring creators who have shaped the world of entertainment.